guidelines on hypertension, high blood pressure, generally recommend measurement of blood pressure in both arms in the initial visit. They also suggest that the arm with higher blood pressure recording should be used to record blood pressure in subsequent visits. It is often mentioned that there is a small difference in the blood pressure between the arms and usually it is the right arm blood pressure which is higher. Blood vessels to both arms arise from the largest blood vessel in the body supplying oxygenated blood known as iota. The origin of the blood vessel to the right arm is in line with the initial part of the iota. It is presumed that the force of ejection of the left ventricle is conveyed more to the right arm blood vessel for this reason. Left ventricle is the lower muscular chamber of the heart which pumps blood to the whole body. When there is a significant difference in the blood pressure between the arms, this explanation is not enough. Partial obstruction to one blood vessel is an important reason for lower blood pressure in that arm. Obstruction of blood vessel in the arm is a pointer to disease of blood vessels elsewhere in the body. They are more prone to have heart attack and stroke brain attack due to disease of their blood vessels. Important risk factors for diseases of blood vessels are high blood pressure and sugar, high blood fat levels, overweight, obesity and smoking. Advancing age, heredity and male gender are also risk factors for diseases of blood vessels. Difference in blood pressure between the arms is more likely in the presence of risk factors. Another important serious disease which has to be thought of in a person with pain in the chest or upper part of back is aortic dissection. Aortic dissection is tear in the inner lining of the aorta. Blood seeps into the wall of the aorta and spreads along the wall of the aorta. As this progresses, it can obstruct the openings of the major branches. In those coming to emergency department with severe chest pain or upper back pain, if there is a large difference in the blood pressure between the arms, this serious condition has to be thought of. Among the blood vessel diseases, an important variety is obstruction due to inflammation of the aorta known as aortoarthritis. The disease is also known as Takeyasu arthritis after the person who described it. It is also known as pulseless disease as arm pulses may be absent due to obstruction of the blood vessels. It is a progressive disease with more and more blood vessels getting affected as time passes. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe, like, share and post your valuable comment below this video.